Hello guys, today I will show you how to reinstall Steam OS on your Steam Deck step by step. Before we get into the tutorial, I want to explain the two scenarios that we need to reinstall the Steam OS. First scenario, if you have Windows or other operating system installed on your Steam Deck's internal SSD, but now you want to get rid of them and use the Steam OS only. The second scenario is, if you break your Steam Deck, by reinstalling Steam OS could be a fix. If you are not in those two scenarios, perform a factory reset from your Steam OS. It is simple to do, and it will fix most of the problems. Just always keep in mind, by reinstalling Steam OS on your Steam Deck, all the data on your internal SSD will be removed. Now let's get into the tutorial. Stuff that required. A Windows PC. A keyboard, one USB flash drive at least 8GB, one USA to USB-C adapter, or a USB hub. If your keyboard has the built-in touchpad just like mine, so the mouse is not necessary in this tutorial. That's all the stuff we need. Let's move to step 1, create a recovery flash drive. I will do this process on a Windows PC, but you can definitely do the same thing from a Mac or Linux system. Let's move to my laptop screen. First, we need to download the Steam Deck Recover image from Steam official website. The download linked in this video description. Let's click on the download. Check the box, then click download Steam OS Deck image. It took about 5 minutes to finish the download for me. So please just be a little bit patient here. Once the download is finished, we can now move to the Rufus website and download the Rufus. Also, it's linked in my video description. We need Rufus to build the recover image into our USB flash drive. So just click on Rufus 3.2 and download the latest Rufus here. Once the download is done, just click on Rufus and run it. I will just minimize the internet browser here. Now I will just plug the USB flash drive into my PC. Back to my laptop screen, we can see the USB flash drive has been detected by the Windows. On the Rufus, make sure under device, you selected the USB flash drive that you just plugged in. Then under the boot selection, select the Steam Deck recover image that was downloaded previously. Make sure you check the box in front of list USB hard drives. The partition scheme should be MBR. Target system should be by us. Then just hit the start button. So this message just remind you that your USB flash drive will be formatted. So just click yes. This process took me about 10 minutes. So just be patient. After it's done, this window will pop up and just close it and then close the roofers. We can now eject the USB flash drive from our Windows PC. Now just unplug the USB flash drive and it is ready to use in step 2. Now let's close the laptop and move to step 2, reinstall SteamOS from recovery mode. This is the USB flash drive we created as step 1. Plug in this USB flash drive with a USB-C adapter or a USB hub, then plug into the Steam Deck. First, press the volume down button, then press the power on button. Once you hear the beep sounds, release them together. Now the Steam Deck will boot into Boot Manager. Make sure you select the USB flash drive here to boot up your Steam Deck. This boot up will take about 5 minutes, so be patient here. Now we have booted into Steam Deck Recover Mode and click on the Reimage Steam Deck. This pop-up window just informs us that by doing this process, all the data on your Steam Deck will be destroyed, and this cannot be undo. Make sure you understand this before you click on the process. I will just hit the process to reinstall the Steam OS. This whole installation process will take about 10 minutes, so just leave the deck here and you can come back in a while. After the installation process is done, we will get this pop-up window. Just click on the process. The Steam Deck will now boot into the brand new Steam OS that we just installed. Here you go guys, now we have a brand new Steam OS on your Steam Deck, just like the first day you got your brand new Steam Deck. Nothing on the SSD but the Steam OS. If you think what I just shared with you is helpful, please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. By the way, I have another video on top here show how to make the Steam Deck screen looks vibrant and pop. Please check it out if you are interested. Thanks for watching.